Absolutely. Every, look, if you stand behind the dispatch box, you can find a stat that works for you. And the, but the reality is that if you are anybody living in this country at the moment, how do you feel now compared to how you feel so four or five years ago? We can talk about the pandemic and it had an impact. Some things have happened that are not the government's fault. But rushing us out of the European Union with a really shocking deal, that has caused poverty across the country and damaged businesses around the country, in my communities and beyond. And also, let's not forget, I mean, Jeremy Hunt talked about coming into office as though it was a change of government, what, 18 months or so ago. It wasn't. The Conservative Party tanked the economy in October 22 and he came in and, you know, kept them in the relegation zone. So I think that the reality is that we're we're looking at a, a I suppose, a budget speech, which was all about headlines and press releases. No normal person cast the vote based on what an opinion poll says or what a headline says or what a press release says. They'll vote on the basis of how do they and their family feel. Can they see a dentist on the NHS? Can they get a GP appointment? Are they getting seen quickly when they've been diagnosed with a horrific disease? Do they feel able to meet the family uh, budget, the shopping uh, budget this week? Can they afford the rent or the mortgage? And the answer is negative to nearly all of those questions for most people in the country. So I suspect, nicely delivered, nice man, don't think it will shift the dial.